hey guys welcome back to my channel my name is rose and in today's video i am going to do a get ready with me so um i just showed you guys um my pond lotion my favorite lotion of all times and i found out that it doesn't have spf in it i don't know why i never looked but yeah it has no spf in it and i'm looking for a moisturizer to add on top of my ponds that has spf for the summer because you know you gotta get that spf you know you just have to and also um my friends were in the room um while i was filming so if you see me looking to the side and talking and stuff i'm not crazy i'm just talking to my friends so now i'm just gonna do my eyebrows um you guys have seen my eyebrow routine like i do it all the time um probably gonna skip over to something else Okay, so now I just grab my um, MAC Stroke Cream and Peach Light just to put on my cheeks just for a little extra glow. And also, excuse the sunlight, guys. I just, I don't know what happened. But yeah. Um, and I think next I put my Fast Response Eye Cream. Um, I've been doing more skincare lately just to see um, how my makeup would be under like all these products and stuff. So it's looking really good. Um, for now, but we'll see. I just might change the products a little bit So for my eyes, I had like a basic eye look I just used the two two browns from the warrior 2 palette by Juvia's I used the lightest brown all over my eyes and then the darker brown just on the outer corners Just to outline and shape my eyes Next, I grabbed my Huda Beauty Electric Obsession and I got the color blue and I put it all under my eyes because I wanted a dramatic look under my eyes. I didn't really want anything um, on my eyelids, so I just put that blue in my bottom lash line. So I'm going to use my regular regular MAC Studio Fi Fix Fluid in the shade NW55. Um, I just put like three or four squirts of that. I don't really need a lot of foundation because my skin has been looking really good lately and I love that. Um, now I'm just grabbing my Juvia's Place um, Concealer, I think in the shade 11. And this is where I made a mistake guys. Um, I didn't put my concealer before doing the blue. Um, next time, if you guys want to repeat this look, put your concealer first and then put the blue eyeshadow. Because see how like now it's just like I had to go back and then redo it. It was, it was a lot. It was a lot. See, I'm just redoing it right now because um, the concealer went over it a little bit. For highlight, I'm just using the same highlight I've always used for my inner corner highlight. I'm using the Warrior One palette by Juvia's. Um, it's my favorite of all times for highlights. And now I just grabbed the Becca powder. I think it's called Set Refresher, something like that. I don't remember. But yeah, I just grabbed it as like a first base for translucent powder. Now I grab my Sephora um, press powder, I think in the shade 68 Mocha. And then I'm going to grab my MAC Blot Powder Pressed and the shade Dark. Mm -hmm. 
so now i'm going to use my girls um lash collection the golden air collection by kika la diva shop shoko beautistic um and get 10 percent off using my code rose medics um she has lashes and now she has lipsticks so yeah go support and um i i picked shooting star um i think i showed you guys blaze but i ended up picking shooting star for this look um and i'm just applying my mac lipstick i don't remember the name so i'll put it down below and i just put my fancy gloss on top of that lipstick and i had a brown liner also That was it for today's look you guys um it was a very basic and simple get ready with me with a pop of blue um subscribe to my channel like and comment and turn on your post notification to be notified every time i post a new video and go shop um on my etsy shop at all things rose medics um and yeah bye guys